Go ahead. Okay, this is Christmas 1999. Today is January the 3rd, the year 2000, unbelievably. We got through the Y2K, and here we are. I thought I might start off with the unexpected gift, sweaters, this year. This is a very nice sweater. <laughs> which I got, which I like very much, and when the kids saw it, they couldn't remember whether they'd last seen it on Joey or Dade Rose. <laughs> Joe was sure it was Dade's, but it's a very nice sweater, indeed. I like it very much. This one <clears throat> was one we think belonged to do. It was Joey's. This was Joey's, I'm sorry. One was Dade's and one was Joey's. I like it. I like it very much. These hand-me-ups have been coming very handy as I've grown old and we're too broke to afford new sweaters. And then, of course, this one. And this was the mystery sweater. We don't know whose this was, but we do remember seeing it on one of the Rich Boys or possibly the Rose Boys. But it's a very nice sweater. It was Joey's, and I bought all three of them they were all Joey's. at Joey's Garage Sale. One of the best beautiful. gifts I got, I bought almost a year ago in Boston at the outlet store and was allowed to give them to myself for Christmas about 12 months later. These are New Balance shoes, which I thank myself for very, very much. And another very special gift was this little mouse pad, Compliments of the American Feed Industry Association, or www.afia.org. And that will come in very handy as my four or five other dozen mouse pads wear out. So that's a very fine gift. This one is one of my favorites. How they can get a piece of this equipment manufactured and shipped all the way from China for 99 cents is a modern miracle. It is a shower squeegee, or as they say, I guess in China, a raclette pour doucher. Avec crochet, a very fine. Well, it helps you keep your share clean. Piece of equipment, and then of course these non-returnable Eddie Bauer trowel that I hope will fit. I don't know why we keep labels on them since we can't take them back, but anyway, looking very much forward to wearing those and these slightly used one previous owner only Eddie Bauer. Those are brand Levi's new Eddie Bauer's with a button fly. Is that Special good? feature. Is that good or bad? I don't know. That's the old style. And then, actually, the most thoughtful gift of all, which is already out of the box and been borrowed, people have been hounding me to use it all week, is nothing other than my very own Proctor Silex Ultra Ease Iron. I've been so tired of begging Jane to use her iron <laughs> over the years, which we got for our wedding, and which she doesn't want to make look used in case she wants to give it away for another wedding gift someday. So I got my very own iron, and it's been a very, very popular thing. And from the kids, I got a campsite number two, Kelty Tent, trying to encourage me to take up camping again, which we haven't done for seven or eight years. But this will be, if we ever do go camping, a wonderful asset, along with this Coleman stove and sleeping bag combination. It goes down to 15 degrees. Wow. Now, you'll freeze at 15 degrees, but the bag won't. The bag still, the zipper still works clear down to 15 degrees above zero. So I'm looking forward to sleep. Excuse me, i so To sleeping out in my Coleman sleeping bag and my Kelty tent. This is very fine gear. Okay, is there anything else you got? That's pretty much it. Anything from your parents? Nope. No. No. Didn't get another thing. What yeah. did they give me? You got money. No, I didn't get money. Lots of money from your parents. I haven't seen it. Haven't seen a bit. Uh, d tell them what you you've been doing this year. What's happened to you? Well, I got sick about a week after Thanksgiving, and I've been in bed and dying almost <laughs> on a daily basis since. I quit my job at NextLink and I'm pretty well unemployed. I've been released as stake president. And here I sit in a bathroom. <laughs> I'm going to sit in my rocking chair and after about a year, if I'm up to it, I may start to rock. <laughs> and so that's funny. what I'm doing. Funny. I'm not going over busying myself with Howell's 
and uh, Horizon Paint Company business to try to help that business, those businesses along, which are doing very well. And um, I think I'll sign off now, but it was a very, very nice time. I've enjoyed this little session very much. We're leaving for Hawaii tomorrow morning. We have to get up at 3 to catch the airplane, and so we'll be tired. But yeah. it'll be a happy time with Annie screaming and Jake crying and making messes all over the airplane.